The next knee issue we're going to cover today is pain in back of your knee or on either side of the knee. And once again, the concepts and principles that I've been talking about ever since I've been sending, it, sending you these videos is about creating comfort in the knee. And having pain in the back of the knee and on either side of the knee is going to be no different. So the highest leverage thing you can do right now would be to get into my virtual clinic. And you see what happens is when the knee hurts, when you have pain behind the knee, and a lot of times people will develop Baker cysts in the back of your knee. And this is common because what happens is you can think of it when your knee hurts and holds tension, it's like you get a kink in the garden hose. And of course there's pressure that builds up and swelling and things like that. And because of that pressure, the pain in back of the knee, there, there's a lot of fluid that ends up sitting there for a period of time. And after that stuff sits there, it has the tendency or can develop a cyst in back of the knee. You can also have issues on either side of the knee. You might have uh, tweaked or twisted your knee somehow, and then you have pain on the either, either sides of your knee. All of it is a function of, you, you know, your knee bends majorly like this. This is how the knee bends. But what most people don't talk about are the minor, uh, the intrinsic movements that the knee has. Meaning it slightly twists, it slightly goes forward and back, and it slightly goes side to side. Now these aren't huge movements. These are just micro, micro movements. They may be only a millimeter or a half a millimeter that your knee is slid to either side. However, that's enough to put the pressure on the nerves in your knee and cause the pain on either side or in the back of the knee. So here's what you can do. I go over and get in depth in my virtual clinic on these types of issues with the knee these subtle intrinsic movements that I was talking about just a minute ago. So what I would do is I would get into the virtual clinic, get into the stretching lounge, and in the stretching lounge, go to the passive stretching section, which is halfway down, watch the intro video, and focus on videos one or modules one through seven. Those are going to be the highest leverage videos that you could work on that's going to address the pain that you have in back of your knee or on either side. So that, that's what I would suggest you do right now. That's going to be a real high leverage activity for you to do to move you from where you're at to where you want to be, which is out of chronic knee pain, not thinking about your knees. So go ahead and do that now. If you have more questions, if this video wasn't clear enough, feel free to sign up for a free Knee Freedom Strategy Session with me. It's a 25-minute session. We'll cover all of the different topics, that questions that you would have regarding what's going on with your knee, why it hurts, what's causing the pain, and the highest leverage thing you can begin doing that is going to get you out of pain the quickest. So go do one of those right now so you can start living your life and quit thinking about your knees. So uh, I'm really excited about it and looking forward to seeing you inside.